It's me. Oh. Extraordinary. <laughs> Take me to Diagonelli. Another wand, another. Hey, y'all get back to class. All right, me and Professor OG got some shit to talk about. I'm special around you. You said I'm very freaking bright. All right, what up, daddy? I mean, flick of the wrist. Flick of this wrist. The flick of these nuts. What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, IBS Kelso, man. We're back. All right, let's go talk to Professor OG over here, Ronan. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Oh, so I'm special, huh? That's what they all say. You know I'm a fifth year, right? I got held back three years. Wait, I mean, uh, yeah. Alright. Hello Hang there. On. You're the new student, aren't you? Yeah, what it to you? Samantha Dale. What up? Jamal Hello. Wilmington. You want to speak to me? Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. You Hope your me? first day's going well. You it certainly is. seem to hold your own in charms. You know the vibes. Yeah, it's kind of useful. <laughs> I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Oh, so then you again, he okay. tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Oh, so you're dumb. You better start waving that run. Revelier. Reveliers. Where that chest at? All right, bet. Oh, yeah, we made it here, baby. A quest. Alright. We started Weasley after class. Okay. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing. It's you. a house elf. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. You better get out of here, cuz. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecat and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Nothing more, Professor. I see. Yeah, I ain't no snitch. I'm trying to get a sonnet from a streela. Regardless, yep. you must continue to build say. upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now. Regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. 
I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. See, I would say Natty Daddy, but I don't want her trying to fall in love with me. So I'm going to say Sebastian, and I hope that's not the sake of what he thinks it is going to be. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallow is a capable young wizard, and he knows the area. Also, He'll he's going to respect well me clear and respect of any my of Victor Rookwood's undesirables really en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've okay. finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Hell yeah! Let's go to Cooterville. I mean, what? That's complete. Weasley after class. I could. Speak to Professor Ronan to receive your first assignment. Assignments are types of quests given to you by Hogwarts professors that, when completed, reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the Mending Charm of Pero, which is required to complete other quests. Alright. <clears throat> cool to do it, man. I'm tired of all this running. Alright, yeah, Hey, y'all get back to class! Alright, me and Professor OG got some shit to talk about. I'm special around you. You said I'm very freaking bright. All right, what up, Daddy? I mean, look. you have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed, I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Repero. Fixes Repero. things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. We will have you casting Ropero in no time. All right, cool. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Yes, Daddy, I'll do it. Professor Ronan's assignment. All right. Collect the flying page in the defense against the dark arts. This is the right area. There it is. I wonder where the flying page is. Oh, I think it's repair. Wait, no, it's when guardian. Oh no, it's. Akio. Got it. God. Okay. Oh my God! There it is. Akio. Brilliant. Sick. I'm getting the hang of it. Hey, move, bitch! See, we're trying to get the glass. I trust the preliminary tasks weren't too much trouble. Hell no, nah, I'm a fucking G car. I completed the special. assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, Man, look at the, your wand look at the flick is a this conduit of your magic. Flick at these. Reparo! Oh, yeah. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Well, allegedly, I ain't heartbroken. Or maybe I am. I don't know. All right, let's get it. Reparo. Reparo. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> you know the vibes. Who this? Who are you screaming at? Probably a dragon up there, lab back in the day. Yeah, I saw one too. Boy. Hey, y'all get back to work. 
Fancy meeting you here. Hey, you know the vibes. Listen, it's only because I didn't want to get on a date with Hello, the other Sebastian. girl. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavor to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. She Has does. she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor her, would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. Why'd you get this? Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well rounded. Stupid. Thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section. And I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh. How the hell do you walk? Just one like moment. That? This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Look! What's going on? Hippogriff! See for yourself. Quite a sight. It's Hippogriff! You certainly what don't up, see that every day. Oh, don't, don't you worry, Poppy's little dude. I'll oh, be the judge of that. Absolutely. Hey, shut up. To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Oh, out of bounds. Hence the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Well, you know, it's kind of crazy. Ah, the hippo you can see Hogsby just past there. those ruins up ahead. Mr. Moon. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Where Good luck you? to both of you. Uh, peace out. A guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. This was a fucking run. Honestly, if one could bottle the magic of this place, I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, some spell crafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with a new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Merlin's blooming beard. Not again. I'll be right with... Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. How do you know me? Ah, uh, mm. hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Hmm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes, hmm, powerful core. 
Ten and a half inches? Hmm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Oh dear. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Mm, no, not you. Uh, uh, mm, perhaps, yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Oh, 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 goodness. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Holy shit. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Think you might be the one. Here, take it. Hmm, the elm. Yes, this is the one I got from uh, from online. You uh, when you you know get accepted into your house and Gryffindor and all that. So uh, wood type elm, loved it. Core type phoenix feather, flexibility pliant. Wand length, 13 and 3 quarters inches. Wand style. How intriguing. It's pretty sick. I might have to check these out. Oh my god. Curious indeed. Dude, what would I want? <laughs> I'm, I'm at lost of... Of ways, dude. I How don't know. intriguing. What's the best one? This is a fucking stick. This one might be the one. Honestly, probably gonna go with this. Uh, it's really, really looks nice indeed. to me. Yeah, maybe like a light brown, sandpaperish wood style. Oh no, How I want to keep intriguing. I want to keep that. I think I want to keep everything. You know, it's like my first wand, you know, maybe I can touch up on it later. The hair of unicorn that serves as the core of wand known for producing consistent magic. Dragon heartstring that serves at the core of the wand known for producing powerful magic. Feather of phoenix that serves as the core of wand capable of producing a great range of magic. Um, honestly, you know, like where it says the dragon heartstring serves a wand known for producing power magic. And then you have to also have the unicorn hair to where it says known for producing consistent magic. I feel like in this game, obviously you want to be powerful, but you also want to be consistent. You might be able to shoot like a fucking hard aver cadaver, but what's the odds of, you know, what, what's the percent percentage of you like landing that? So I think I want to be consistent. Hmm. Powerful, a unicorn you know, like, hair hey, wand you, you is be able most to reliable and, right, and know, faithful to its owner. It's purchase. So... Oh, just my what do you think? Oh my god. It's me! Oh. Extraordinary. Take me to Diagonelli! <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sense the sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Indeed. Treat it well, and you shall find no more dependable a wand than one with a unicorn hair core. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new one's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. 
Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Fuck yeah, dude. Come on, man's walks. <laughs>